Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Amy. Thanks so much for stopping by today to spend some time with me. Today I have a really fun project share. Um, I was able to pick up the Anna Griffin. It's called the Anna Griffin Finishing School Flower Shop Craft Box. So this is what it looks like. It's, um, it's quite large. And this is uh, one of the kits that she has a lot of different kits like this on her website. And some of them they, they sell also on HSN. This one was the flower shop. And then it has a drawer that pulls out like this. And then inside there is always a die set. And then there's like a project sheet that shows you um, like examples for, you know, different kind of ways that you can, you know, put the, put the card kit together and then it's got some instructions and then on the front there is also a code um so there's a code you there's actually six classes that come with the purchase of this kit and so these are really amazing kits um if you're not familiar with them i really love them i have a lot of anna griffin kits and the nice thing too is now anna griffin is doing this thing on her website she has it's called agtv so what i'm going to show you today are actually two projects that they're not part of the um the classes that come free with the kit they actually were um, some video tutorial, a tutorial that she did live on her website. So if you go over to her website up at the top, it says AGTV and you just click on that. And two weeks ago, she, or two or three weeks ago, she had done three different projects with this kit. And that's what I, I made today. So I was really excited to get this kit and work with it. These are the dies that you get. This is what they look like. So it's, it makes an easel, like it's just a standard easel die. And this one makes a flower shop. So anyway, this is one of the, um, one of the things that I created from her tutorial and it is just adorable. So I don't know if you can see in the details here, but in the back, there's some glare, sorry about that. In the back here, you can see it's a dimensional box and you can see that there are, there's flowers in the back and it actually, it is a box, it's a functioning box and um, the door is open on mine. So if you were gonna put something that would easily fall out, you definitely wouldn't wanna do that, but it is so cute. And then in the kit, there are, um, not in the kit, in another one of her, she has an, uh, an embossing folder um, that does make the, um, the like the different uh, walls. There's like two different walls. And anyway, this is from an embossing folder of hers. And so it just ends up looking like an actual brick, brick, brick building. And then it's got the cute little awning. Most of everything in here was actually included except for, except for the embossing folders. And then you got the little kitty cat in the window. And then you've got all those little beautiful flower embellishments. And then you've got the door here, which like I said, this one does work. And then it looks like you've got a little patio, so it sits upright and it's got a little doormat here. And I just think it's just so stinking cute. I just absolutely love it. I could not wait to get this kit because it's, it's just so cute. And then another one of the projects that she did in that tutorial was this one. This is just, this one is an easel card. So it stands up like this. And um, so this one is an easel card and it just came out really beautiful. Um, so as you can see here, it also looks very dimensional. Um, you could achieve this with just pop dots, but in the video, she actually shows us how, what she did was she used one of her dies to do this. And basically they're like a frame um, that goes around the outside in lieu of using pop dots. You could just use pop dots or you don't even have to use anything at all to pop it up. But it gives this adorable, like it makes it look like a building. Like it's absolutely amazing. Um, like I said, she used a die, but you could totally do this on your own. Um, I've seen people do it because this basically what you're doing is just making a tube and then forming it around the sides. So then she has two different layers of the base one here and then inside you can see again there's the little flowers inside the flower shop and there's a cute little window and an awning the little fl the flower shop sign and back here you can see there's a little sign on the door and then there's more flowers inside the flower shop and then you've got the little kitty and then you've got flower pots on the outside and then there's a little a little light here on the side of the building and then it just stands up 
and I just think it came out so cute. I was so excited to try these out. So anyway, so just a really quick project share. I just wanted to share these with you guys. Um, yeah, so if you want to check these out and see her video, like I said, it's free on her AGTV. Just go over to um, over to her website. Anyway, thanks so much for stopping by today and spending some time with me, and I hope you guys have a great weekend. Thanks. Bye.